Okay. Now that we get all that stuff out of the way, and we get the dog, I can get out of here. You'd think my endings of these would get less awkward as time goes by. I'm, I'm not very much better at these than I was when I started. I'm going to go this way, just to see what's out here. I and mean, I think I know what's out here, but just to be on the safe side. Yeah, this is this is a bad way to go. Let's see. It's Warwick. They they talk to me about things down there. The University Point. Okay, well, we we survived up here. I can probably survive down there to do those. Um heck is up here? Salem's up that way? Eh, we can probably pull that as Saga's Ironworks. That's where... So... The slog is like right here. Or right there. One or the other. It's the slog. Saga's Ironworks. That's one way to go. That's Malden. Haven't been to Malden. I think that's a vault in Malden. And then... Salem and Longneck Lukowski's. Um, those places. Longneck Lukowski is where Vault 81's wandering uh, girl is. I think I'm going to turn around and head back that way. Sort of towards Saugus, but maybe not too Saugus. And we'll, uh, we'll head around. I just, I don't trust myself down there. I know there's there's a uh, King Meyer lurks around here, and they're dangerous. Those are like way out of my pay grade. So this part here, that's the downs. Is there anything over this way I should check out? Not necessarily, but just some junk. Music got weird. Yeah, this is still the downs. Check this fountain out. Nothing on this one. Let me check this building out. Can I check this building out? Everything, seriously. Man, this whole place was like... Bombed up. That was weird. I should have been able to jump that. Anyways. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Going over here, but I think I'm I think I'm safe. It's not attacking me. Alright. Hold that off. Is there anything down here?
This is just slightly different than the other way we went, so... That's just some mushrooms and beach buggy thing and an old stand there. Okay, yeah, nothing, nothing to really look at. Meyer Lurk might come back for us in a second. Caution. Nope. Nope, doesn't see us. Alright. Back over this way. That's a plane. Nothing here. That's kind of dumb. That's a place where they ambush you with stuff. Pretty commonly. Do, do, do. All right. Um. Oh right, yeah, we're going just sort of back up the road. Which is essentially my plan. Because we don't know what's down here. This is still a downs. The downs are huge. My word. Oops. That's it. It might. Someday we might find out that raiders are a rabbit or something like that. Bah. <laughs> Muffled something. Good pieces, good pieces. There we go. To survive so many years undamaged, what luck. Damn it. Floral bouquet. Or no, what you call it? Grenade bouquet. Oops. Didn't see it. Caught me by surprise. This is just the other side of the stands. Yeah, and then we're in there already. All right, so out. Out, damn spot. All right, and uh, on to greater things. Northbound, up the thing here. Although I do want to check around just for really quick. Uh, any of these buildings? Are any of them open? No. Alright. This is a uh, red rocket? It is, but it's like a... Like a quick stop red rocket. <laughs> There's no building. Unless that was it. Here. 
here. This is a uh, dangerous, it would seem. East Boston. Okay. I feel like I feel like this is a thing I'm supposed to check. I can go in there. Uh-huh. Yeah, let's do this. Let's explore. Raiders. What? What the fuck was that? Man, these are spazzy raiders. Huh? Holy no crap. Now. You hear that? There's a ton of them. It's got ambush all over it. Hey, I think someone's out there. Who's out there? They seem like they're upstairs, Rip but who's there? I found him. Get down, get down. <laughs> Okay, cut the shit. Who is that? <laughs> hey, who's there? Did you hear something? What was lost is found. Imminent threat detected. Seventy-four. Identity unknown. Someone's out there. Let's keep chucking grenades at them. Danger detected. Evade. Oh, oh think something's <coughs> broken. I would prefer if there was a whole lot less of that. Engaging oh. defensive countermeasures. Critical oh. damage imminent. Request. It is very still, is it not? Are you going to stop this crap? I think we're safe. Sort of for now. We're safe. Check everything. Keep it down. I hear someone coming. Get into position. Don't quit, do ya? These appear worthless. Surely we can leave that behind. Shh. Quiet. I've done this hundreds of times. Think you'll be any different? I killed about seven in the other one, so yes. Yes, I do.
thought I heard rad roaches, but oh yeah, I did. Curry, where'd she go? Drop dead already. <laughs> Here and shit. There's no one on this floor with me. I don't know where they're coming from. And that guy might be. A tuxedo, ooh. These guys have no clue what's coming for them. Like, I am... I am here... to kick ass and chew bubblegum. And I am all out of bubblegum. I think he's in the next room over. Hmm. I think there's a guy down here. The jet will make you jittery. Yeah, yeah he's over here. Shoot. Oh. Yeah, you know let's just go. Here's someone. Combat position. Plenty. Out there. They're above us. And they're freaked out. You'll run out of bullets at some point. They're just gonna grenade spam till they get there, so that's okay. We're good. Hey. As long as we stay out of range of the grenade spam. Ha! Where'd it go? Somewhere there was a thing. Booming combat operations. Yeah. 
Yep. Your actions could result in injury. Oh, they have. You should wash your hands after that. It can be unsanitary to handle the deceased. No, they're already dead. It's it's okay, Kiri. Why is everything so dangerous up here? Where is it? No! Getting tired yet? Where are you? I think she's the only one left up there anyways. Is there another staircase? That's so. Just getting warmed up over here. Violent tendencies greatly decrease your life expectancy. Body parts everywhere, man. I do not see them anymore. Oh, that's... No, carry! Ah. Whew. Sorry. <laughs> Why don't you just die? Okay, this is where the ones were that I killed before. Okay, so they're up there. Alright, let's just go take her out. Two more of them. They're over the other side here, so entirely sure how to get to them. Jail cell. Weird. I really like how they handle the raiders. Like they're all just like way too weird. That wasn't really a spatula, that looked like a friggin' cleaver. Alright, recruit, fish face. Beat him until his face swelled up and he couldn't eat. Let him heal, then beat him again. After a couple rounds of this he got skinny quick. When we pulled him out for the last round, he told us he'd do anything, we just stopped. Made him sign the blood contract and put him immediately on the infiltration crew, on the initiation crew, actually. Not infiltration. Blah. Rock teeth. Guy didn't flinch from the usual stuff, not even tooth removal. He wanted to keep his eyes in hand, so he signed the blood contract. Beggar. He kept pleading with us to kill him. Didn't understand why we didn't just do all the other gangs did. Starvation and regular beatings freaked him out, but the threat of death by rats broke him. Huh, weird. These are very... Shame. These are very strange raiders. They seem to have like a operation going on. I mean, they're all, they all have operations. They're all very strange. But they, uh, they were keeping prisoners for recruits. Got it. You don't usually see that in these. as well. EXP, you know. Sweet. There we go. 
Anything? No, just a pile of cells. A lot of them. Yet another. They must have had... I didn't notice if all those guys had names. I don't think they did. They were just raider gunners and stuff. Hmm. Interesting. Well, this is the side where I saw all those people, so... We will be running into some readers soon. Check this terminal out. Recruit Stinky! Tried breaking down with isolation. He responded to fire. Signed the blood contract after he burned the soles of his feet a couple of times. Thanked us for the food after. Hmm. Red Finger. Little reaction to broken fingers. Couldn't stand tooth removal with pliers. Signed the blood contract after starvation and threat of losing fourth tooth. Killer. This guy must have been killing for a while with another crew. Bastard smiled at everything we did. He liked getting tortured. Spit in our faces. We had to put him down. Huh. These are... Honestly? These are very weird. Very, very weird craters. So those two that I saw are over here somewhere. They didn't kill themselves. This is somewhere I haven't been. I don't even want to know what they were doing with those buckets. I'll just take them and not question it. There they are. Haha. <laughs> Oh, bone saw. Oh, that's Curie. Sometimes you have to tweak them so you can tell where they are. Is this well This world above ground is very confusing. Wow, there's a ton of stuff here. Eh. Getting shook up over nothing. No, there's still people here. It was playing the victory music, like. Jet. Jet. She's dead ahead. Everything's starting to sound like footsteps these days. Hiding from me? Not even possible. I must have a concussion. I'm fucking seeing things. <laughs> what the?
Weird. It's called shooting straight, rookie. Nothing. At least it sure as hell looks that way. How much you got left in you? What? Where are you? This is bullshit. Come out and fight. I'm not really hiding. That goes to the Commonwealth. They're not down there. The jet will make you jittery. Yeah, she was right. You gotta reload sometime, asshole. <laughs> oh, that's trapped. Uh, where's the gun? Oops. That's it. Tons of stuff. Ooh, astoundingly awesome tails. Plus, right away heals plus five percent radiation damage. Huh. This is a place I never would have come. And I not decide to go exploring. No more computers in here. They're working. Um, no, there's plenty of noise. I hear them. They're like a head over there. Didn't I go through all this though? She should be like right here. There's one left. I think. But that one that's left is probably out that Commonwealth door that I saw. Let's go find that Commonwealth door again. Is it back here? Presume it's out here. <laughs> and seeing more of them inside. Of course, there's a rad storm going on. Sure. Hey. You need something, yes? Hey. A moment, please. Okay. What is it? I owe you so very much, and I do not mean to sound ungrateful, but I fear I am barely holding myself together. It's all right. I'm here for you. Thank you. That means so much. Becoming a synth is just so overwhelming. At first, it was a struggle just to master basic functioning. How to brush the teeth, how to operate with only two hands, etc. But now I am full of inconsequential thoughts, feelings. How do you do everything with this whirlwind in the head? Well, I hope some of these inconsequential feelings involve me. Yes. No. And see, now my head goes ever more. Spin, spin, spin. You make it look so effortless. Like breathing, but for me, it is so hard to focus, to do research, and the inspiration is as elusive as ever. I fear I will never contribute anything to the world. Mm -hmm. The world? Not so sure, but 
You've certainly made a difference to me. More feelings. No words for them. The saving grace in all of this is you. As a robot, I had much appreciation for you. But now, it is deeper. I am still loyal. But now I do this because I want to. Because you are my friend. Aww. So, just friends? Nothing more than that? I feel very funny. I must cut this short. My eyes, they are malfunctioning. Adieu. <laughs> I made her nervous. But I succeeded. All right. Next time I'll probably need to put my suit on to do that. Anyways, um, I had to go hunt down this last guy, but I'm going to cut this one here, and I'll probably pick up the next one when I find the dude. So, uh, yeah, otherwise, that should do it. Uh, so thanks for watching, and uh, remember, as always, drop a like. Uh, it helps get me up the list a bit, you know, in terms of uh, views, which helps me get more subscribers and stuff. So it's definitely, you know, more helpful than you probably think it is. But uh, otherwise, um, enjoy. Have a wonderful day. Thanks.